What's up guys, Jason here from Black Oak Outdoors. Um, today, I got something new. Um, I, I got a new ground blind. It is a Baronet Prowler 300. I got it for uh, this upcoming deer season. Since my last ground blind decided to take legs and somebody needed it worse than I did apparently. But uh, anyhow, it's uh, designed for bow shooting and I plan on doing a lot more bow hunting this year. And I've set goals for killing a big buck with my new bow. And today I'm just gonna do a little review on it, a little quick review, and uh, show you what it's all about. Stay tuned. All right guys, this is the inside view of the blind. Uh, it's very spacious. I'm out here in my backyard doing this film, so bear with me here. Uh, it's got eight panels. Uh, they come with uh, the mesh. It has like little tie downs, whatever you wanna call it. Uh, they don't zip, the mesh don't zip, but the outside black panels or the uh, camouflage panels do zip, so when you get done, you zip them up. Uh, that's okay, I guess. I mean, you should have, you probably should get them things down before you plan on hunting. It might be a little noisy. Um, this is the view to my target. It's about 20, 22 yards out from the blind. We'll do a few test shots here in a little bit. Um, it's got a full length of zipper going up down the back of it. I'm about five foot 10 or so and this ceiling is super high. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna say it's probably six and a half foot tall. Um, but yeah, it, it seems like it's pretty good. Uh, the quality is not the greatest. I mean, it's a cheaper ground blind. As you can see, there's like some little pinholes around the seams and stuff and maybe here and there in the uh, canvas material, but that's what you get for a budget blind. And uh, you know, you can get this blind probably around right, right around a hundred dollars, and it's uh definitely well worth it. I've had some baronet blinds in the past, like I said, and uh, they were good blinds, it lasted until it got stolen that one hunting season. So, uh, we'll have to do a little bit of more of a lockdown on this thing come uh, hunting season. It has the quick hub style pop up blind for the pop up blinds. If I'm saying it right, uh, it's like a quick setup, so there's no fumbling around putting poles together and all that mess. It's just a, a quick, uh, quick push of the the hubs there, and it snaps right up, and that's pretty cool. You can have this thing popped up in a matter of a minute. All right, guys, I'm gonna show you the outside here of it. Uh, we have four tie downs, one right here. Or I should say five tie downs because there's one on the very top too. Uh, here's a tie down right here. Now if we walk around here, there's another one towards the front and one right there on that side too. Has the one on the very tip top. This is a Mossy Oak Blood Trail camera, or camo I should say. I'm about to say camera. I guess because I'm holding a camera. But <laughs> anyhow, we'll get a, uh, a deer's perspective of what an arrow looks like when it's getting slung at, uh, slung at them from this ground line.
Guys, I believe that's going to be it for now. I don't have much to really review on this thing because I haven't put it out in the field to test it just here at the house. But I think it'll, uh, I think it'll fit the fit the build quite nicely. Um, got a little little blind chair in there if you can really see it with my bow sitting on it. Just shows you how much room's in this thing. That's a Matthews VXR 31 and a half. So it's a pretty good wide and inside, plenty of room. Plenty of shooting room. As I said, this thing's probably six and a half foot tall. So the cams don't really hit the top. If it was like a uh, smaller, like a 29 inch axis to axis bow or something, it would be even nicer. But I want to say thank you for subscribing to my channel. I just hit 200 subscribers uh, like two days ago. So it means a whole lot to me and uh, this channel. I only do this for fun and I appreciate you guys tagging along with me. I know my videos ain't like top notch like some YouTubers are but I do what I can, and I enjoy filming, and I enjoy getting out in the outdoors. I appreciate you. Like I said, hit the subscribe button, turn the notification bells on, stay with me. We'll enjoy our hunts or fish or whatever it is outdoors. Thank you so much.